Beirut, Jerusalem. December 10, Hezbollah launched explosive drones powerful missiles in positions. While the violence of Lebanon's Israeli border increased and airstrikes shook several towns. Villages in southern Lebanon. Ali Hajazi, a local authority, said that an Israeli airstrike in the town of Air had destroyed five houses and damaged more. Divine intervention prevented anyone from being martyred. Three women and two men were injured. Senior Hezbollah politician Hassan Fadlala told that Israeli airstrikes were a new climb that the group responded with new attacks. Two Israeli soldiers were moderately injured and some of them were slightly injured in shrapnel and smoke inhalation. Israeli fighter jets Hezbollah in the Lebanese region a wide range of strikes on terror targets made a wide range strikes in Beirut. The inhabitants saw things that looked like two fighter planes drawn in an open blue sky and left the steam trails behind them. Hezbollah statements say that their attacks aim to support Palestinians in the Gaza Strip. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu warned that Beirut would turn into Gaza if Hezbollah launched a war. UNAFIL, U.S. peace protection in southern Lebanon, said in a statement that a wrong calculation potential that can trigger wider conflict has increased. In one of several attacks announced by Hezbollah on Sunday, Group said that he started explosive drones in Israeli command position near Yara. In another, Hezbollah said he fired hundreds of kilograms of explosives with Birkin missiles. Israeli airstrikes. The Lebanon village Yaren was reported. The Israeli positions, which is not far from other than anywhere else, said that Hezbollah targets on Sunday. These airstrikes broke a school in Aramaic. A priest in Aramaic, UN surveillance tower hit violence at the border killed more than 120 people in Lebanon. 85 Hezbollah fighters and 16 civilians. Hoses in Israel killed seven soldiers and four civilians. UNIFIL said that Shellil damaged a surveillance tower in one of his positions on Saturday afternoon. The Israeli army said that Hezbollah started several rockets in Israel on Saturday night and one of them was launched 20 meters away from the United Nations compound in southern Lebanon. The Israeli army, Israel, just a few meters away from a U.S. compound continued to shoot from the regions. Hezbollah is endangering the life of Unifile soldiers. He said, there was no Hezbollah response to Israel's statement. UNIFIL said that the targeting of positions is unacceptable too and any use around our attack start. Positions. Reports of Leila Bassam in Beirut Tom Perry and Dan Williams Emily Rose in Jerusalem.